Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Southwood High School, where we have sectional 52 volleyball action between the North Miami Lady Warriors and the Caston Comets. I'm Ashley Moore, and I'm joined by Dennis Walker. Thanks for being here with me today, Dennis. Nice to be here, Ashley. I think we're in for, for a lot of good volleyball today. Um, North Miami and Caston are really pretty evenly matched. So this, we're gonna start with a, a great match here. Caston comes in, gotta get my notes. Caston comes in with a, an eight and 19 record. North Miami comes in with a four and 24 record. We had kind of talked about this before we went live. It's interesting that Caston and North Miami have not played each other. Right. So. They're, uh, they're physically about 10 miles apart. Yeah, it, I mean. Very, very interesting on that, but they do have several common opponents. Matched up with the common opponents pretty evenly with the exception of Cass. North Miami's lost to Cass twice. Caston was able to beat Cass in the, I believe the Cass County Tournament. Right. So, but that was a long time ago. So a lot of things have changed and I'm looking forward to it. After this game, we will have the Pioneer Northfield game Northfield knocked off Southwood on Thursday. Night. Yep. So two to one, and that's an evenly matched game too. So I think we're in for a, for a good day of volleyball. Yes, I think uh, both both these matches will be very, very competitive, very well played. Yeah. <clears throat> so we're about 30 seconds out from getting ready to kick things off. Should be getting ready for national anthem, Star Spangled, or yes, I got Star you. Spangled Banner. But you know, yep. um, <laughs> starting lineups. That's what I was looking for right there. Starting lineup, and I'm excited. It's kind of a warm afternoon in here. Yeah, in it gym, is. So you never really know with gems. So sometimes they're cold, sometimes they're hot. We're all the way up at the top here. All right, we are ready to get underway here with the starting lineups. Love the big, uh, big flag. I know it comes right down from the ceiling. That's awesome. Starting lineups for North Miami. Number two, Emma Wright. Number four, Hoover. Number 24, Joey Whitmire. 
I don't think those are the starting lineup. I don't think that was the starting lineup. No. Just kidding. <laughs> Let's try again here. There we go. Madeline C. Stein. 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 Hoover. Hoover. Number 13, Arianas Rodriguez. Arianas Rodriguez. Marianne Freeman. Marianne Freeman. And number 17, Ellie Musselman. And Non-starters for Caston. Number ten, Bailey Harness. Number fifteen, Lane Oliver. Number thirteen, Delaney Lowry. Number twenty-five, Amelia Lowry. Starting number three, Grace Horn. Number three, Grace Horn starting. Number five, Madison Smith. Number five, Madison Smith. Number six, Abby Williamson. Number eight, Rachel Rogers. Number eight, Rachel Rogers. Number nine, Sophie Jellison. Number twelve, Rebecca Milburn. And libero number seven, Kyra Estrada. So we kind of talked a little bit before. Uh, Sophie Jellison, just a heck of an out athlete. We see her a lot. Uh, I know in basketball. I'm not sure if she's a softball player as well, but I know for sure in basketball. I don't think she does play softball. If she does, um, I don't remember the name. Yeah. But yeah, Jellison is a uh, is a very good athlete. Her brother is a very good athlete. Yes. So it kind of um, kind of runs in the family. Right. Um, Lane Oliver as well. Um, yes. She's not starting tonight, but um, another outstanding athlete for for the Comets. So. Kind of looking at some stats, uh, Rebecca, or no, Rachel Rogers. Um, let's see here. Rachel Rogers, she's listed at 5'11", so she's got a, a ton of size on her for a single-A school. Um, she does lead the, the Comets and kills. So it'll be interesting to see her kind of match up against a much smaller North Miami team. Uh, yeah, they Tallest are. girl, 5'9". Yeah, I think that was Marianne Freeman and yeah. a few others. Yeah. I know on club ball for uh, McKenzie, which McKenzie Walker is my daughter. Yes. Um, um, the Hoover girl and the C girl both played for her club team one year. Okay. So we've seen them before. And Marianne Freeman is a very good softball player in her own right. So. Oh, definitely. Caston kind of took a blow early on in the volleyball season uh, when Addie Harsh decided to focus more on, yes. on softball and decided not to play volleyball. So we've got number one, Madis Madeline C with a serve. Caston able to, to get it over. North Miami nice with a, yeah, great tip. Hard hit, but out the back. Yes, out the back. Oh, they had somebody in the net. Short oh, serve. those are such tough serves when they just dink over like that. That's an ace. Yeah. This is kind of the start North Miami was looking for, I think. Absolutely. See how Kasten responds. Oh, kind of got two hits. So this referee and crew is going to call two hits. Some, mm -hmm. some do, some don't. Right. As long as they're consistent. Yep. Oh, oh nice beautiful hit, nice hit, hit. by. Rogers. Nope, she's gonna call in the net. Oh wow. In the net. Uh, nope. North Miami used her serving. Number thirteen, uh is that Rodriguez? I think she was more surprised than anybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, it looks like when she brought her arm down for the kill, I think her arm kind of caught the net. Yeah. That was a nice job by North Miami. They're being scrappy. This yes. is good. I mean, this is what the start Mr. Lynn probably wanted for uh, North Miami. Ooh. Another hard hit wow. by Rogers. These are tough to get over. Out. Oh. <laughs> nice. Nice job by North Miami to stick with that, though. It didn't end up. Number 15's going to check in Lane Oliver on the front row for Kasten. Off the antenna. Out. Yeah. Service ace for number nine, Jellison. Freeman on the front row. Oh, wow. Nice, uh, Nicely nice, done. Nice save there. Nice hard hit. Marion Freeman getting the, uh, the job done on the front row. It's still early, but as advertised, yeah, this, is a, this is a fun game to watch. Gonna have a substitution, number two. Coming in for Hoover. Yep, Emma Wright into the front row. Oh, oh another short serve. It's number 17, Musselman. more points the casting coach probably should get a timeout here yeah kind of calm them down say hey everything's all right nice hit nice save in the net point for casting there 25, uh, Johanna Lopez checking in. A lot of substitutions yes. very early. Short serve. Nice little serve there. Back set. Both teams kind of using that little uh, dump right. it over. Yeah. And obviously it's working. Right. I believe that one was Oliver. There's a nice set. Up there. Yeah. Lift. They kind of got out of position and it was a scramble there. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out North Miami who their setter is now. Little miscommunication on the back row there. Okay, C is still in there, so yeah. number one, C is the setter. Too close to the net for that set. Yep. Estrada for Caston has a really hard serve. And she's utilizing the jump serve. A lot of teams right. that I've watched single A don't use the jump serve. We're going to have a timeout, North Miami. We're going to take a quick break. You're watching Caston TV on RTC TV4. At Co-Alliance Propane, we treat our customers like neighbors because, well, that's what we are. When you trust Co-Alliance Propane as your seriously local propane provider, you're trusting a team of professionals who live, work, and watch the game from right across the county, not the country. 
a team that's close by and seriously dedicated to your safety and providing the best service possible. Find out more about Co-Alliance Propane's seriously local service and how you can get 50 gallons of propane free at coalliancepropane.com. Welcome back, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, to sectional 52 volleyball sectionals. Caston leads eight to seven, went on a nice little run and still serving. Estrada, she's got a nice hard jump serve. Overpass, nice play. That was a nice heads up play for Caston. And there goes Rogers. Somebody's in the net. Number five. Number five, who's? Number five is uh, Madison Smith. So side out over to North Miami. Back serve. Oh. It Able to it. stick it. with it. Made it. Tight to the net. Two hits. <laughs> that almost hit the rafters. Yeah, it did. Nice hard hit by Oliver. Maybe a save, it is. Nicely done by North Miami. Oh. Ooh. Wow. Set it up. Another push. Oh, that may have been out of bounds, yeah. but she took it. Yeah, you're right. There's they, a lot of tip. Yeah. A lot of they, tip ball. Four hits. Four hits, yep. Stein with the serve. Not enough on it for Kasten. I couldn't tell whether that hit tape or was that yeah. a, or did she pop, pop it down? Oh, oh this hit. This hit. You could tell when she was going up that wasn't going to end yeah. well. Ooh. Nice block. North Miami there with the block. It was good. Hard hit. Yeah, hard hit. That's really the first hard hit I've seen from North Miami. Right. Tonight. With them being undersized, though. 13. You know. She's, uh, who is that? That's a Rodriguez girl. Okay. Yeah. 5'8". She actually had some hops there. Yes, she up. did. Nice block by number six. That's Williamson. Another hard jump serve. Oh, oh. Rafter. Overpass. It's going to be tough to come. Uh, yeah. Good effort, good effort. North Miami kind of switching things up now with a few more harder hits at the, at the net. Number 12, Milbourne checking in. Wow. 
That was a hard hit. Rodriguez and I believe it was Madeline C was right there at the net. Walk didn't get anything on that one. No. Rachel Rogers is back in the front row for casting. That bodes uh, well for them. Definitely. Back set to Rodriguez. And that's two hits. Yep. They've been very consistent with that. They have. So you know what you're what you're getting. That's in the net. Yeah. Nice hard hit. Yes. She took it right down the baseline. Yep. That one is out. with the serve. Nice hard hit by number five. That is uh, Madison Smith. Lane Oliver back in the lineup. Again, add some athleticism to the front row. Right. Tip over. And Nicely in. done by C. Rotation here. Muscle. Right for Hoover. That was right Try down the line. Yep. Try to catch the baseline. Nice tip. Yeah, North Miami is making this very competitive. It's yes, very absolutely. Good. Nice hard hit. That would have fell in, I think. Yeah. And that's out. I saw in the, the newspaper interview with, I think it was a sectional preview maybe, or, and it's been 19 years since Caston's played in a sectional championship oh, really? game. Yeah. Oh, goodness. Oh. Collision on the floor. Everybody's all right, though. Another hard hit. Ooh, that could have been called two hits, but it was not. Nice set, nice recovery. Three ball. Push. Oh. Uh, nice hard hit, she just didn't get it yeah. at the top. Oh. oh, awkward angle. Yeah, Very tight to the net. Where I'm sitting, as soon as I saw that come out, I'm yeah. like, oh, this is probably not not going to end well. 
anything that tight to net is hard to yes. get over. Oh, two hits. Not called. Again, possibly. Oh, nice recovery nice. by Marion. Time out, Kasten. Well, as advertised, this game has been back and forth, very close. Right now, North Miami leads 21-17. So I think this is going to go to more than uh, three sets. I yeah, think this I is think be, so. This may be a five-setter. Yeah, a dog fight for sure. <laughs> um, you can see Coach Melinda Schultz over there. It's going to be okay, yep. trying to get him settled get him, down. Get him calm down. And she's done an outstanding job with Kasten. Mm -hmm. Last year they won zero games. They okay. won eight this year. So, you know, you have to build the program, and that, that's outstanding on her part. Right. Pioneer folks starting to filter in for yes, they are. the 12:30 match. I see North Miami and Pioneer girls are both on the far side. Yep. Oh, oh wow, oh, nice. nicely done. Way to recover, way to recover. And it's gonna be out. She mishit that, but yeah. it, she mishit it well. Yeah. That was a little bit of a gift for Cask in yes, there. It was. To, yes, it was. To break that up. Rogers back in on the front row, so that's definitely a blessing for for Kasten. Right. Overpass. Oh, overpass. <laughs> nope, that did not go over. No. Nope. Four hits. Good effort, good effort on that. That was kind of just a, a tough Yeah, you're not gonna catch that receive pass and yeah. Best thing you can hope for is try to knock it over the net. Right. Man, she serves low and hard. That was a nice hit from the yes. back row. Maria oh. Finn. Marion's got a lot of power in the upper body. Yes, so she, she does. This is going to be. This is game point. Yeah. Or set point. St. Pauline. Nice hit. And. Bobby <laughs> Williamson. Nice yeah. block. Nope, that wasn't Abby, was it? Was it Abby or was that uh, eight? I missed that, that one. I think it was yeah. Rogers. <laughs> so Horn to serve. Let's see if they've got uh, four more points in them. Marianne Freeman. Nice, nice block. Oh, oh nicely done by Marianne that's Freeman. The game. That's the set for this one. So North Miami takes the first set 25 to 21. 
Chapman. We're going to take a quick break. You're watching Casting TV on, uh, on RTC TV4. At Co-Alliance, we understand the importance of community. After all, we've been farmer-owned since the 1920s. And now that we're a part of your community, we want to become your total agronomy solutions provider. Co-Alliance offers the latest in ag technology for your operation. From field scouting and fertilizers to premium seed and precision agriculture, we can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources of your local cooperative to work. Contact Co-Alliance today. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to sectional 52 volleyball action. North Miami took set number one over Caston, 25 to 21. As advertised, it was a great back and forth. Uh, just a, a lot of great volleyball. It was, it was very good. Uh, very competitive, uh, both teams um, never really got a, a big lead on that one. It right. was just a, a fundamentally well-played game. Yeah. I was surprised from both teams. There wasn't a lot of hard hitting. No. Outside of Rachel Rogers for Caston, who, man, she can hit the ball. She can. And, and so can Marianne Freeman, but a lot of North Miami's points came off of. A small tip. Yeah. Which, you know, it doesn't matter how you get it as long as you get it. So, um, I think Caston, very interesting. Caston will be fine. They just got to clean up a few little things yeah. and they'll be fine. Definitely been fun so far, though. After this match, which I'm going to guess that this is going to be more than three, like you yeah, said. Yep. Um, we will have Northfield and Pioneer. Northfield knocked off Southwood on Thursday, two to one. So very, three very to one. good. Three to one. Three to one. Yeah, yeah that's what I meant. Yeah. They know. No. <laughs> They're North, like, who is North, this girl? <laughs> Northfield took the first two, and yes. then uh, Southwood took the third set. Northfield, not too far from here, just up the kind of up the road. It's yeah. like right down, yeah. right down the highway, really. Yep. So. And actually, <laughs> since I am from North Miami, right. I travel to both these schools quite regularly. Yes. North Miami and I, uh, sorry. Southwood and Northfield, they look exactly the same. Oh, yeah? Yeah, they were both built at the same time when they broke up the Wabash school system. Oh, okay. So they built both of them, and they look exactly the same. Oh, wow. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. I was pretty excited about this volleyball section being here. It was about 12 minutes from my house. Oh. So it <laughs> works out perfectly. And I don't believe I've ever been to Southwood. Okay. Like through my playing career as an adult now. My kids go to Oak Hill, so. We got a little dance going on on the North Miami side. I'm not 100% sure what that was. I, I'm assuming a little ritual that they I, have. I would assume so. I would say that was a senior dance there. Yeah. <laughs> I think those are the, now that they have four seniors, yeah. there's two of them. So Grace Horn, Gracie Horn? Grace? I think it's just Grace. With the serve for Caston to start things off in set two. Marianne with the hit and the kill. And just as I said, no, we no. haven't seen a lot of hard hits. There she comes. Right. I really like these bleachers, the wood bleachers. Mm -hmm. Very like nostalgic looking in the gym. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Miss hit. Lane Oliver checks in for Caston with number nine, Great, um, Jellison. Jellison. Overpass, ooh, almost dunked on. Tight to the net. Setting up Marianne again, nice recovery. Oh. Oh, wow. Such a hard hit by Freeman, too, yes. and.
Oof. Nicely done. See Bud Dodrell in the house now. Kind of Pioneer's unofficial photographer. I think he's the official unofficial photographer. Right, yeah. yeah. I love looking at all of the photos he posts online. We kind of missed him this year a lot because uh, his granddaughter plays for the eighth grade? Yes. Eighth grade. Yeah. And uh, he went to a lot of their games instead of coming to ours for photographs. Right. That's a little hard. We talked about him last night about how great um, landscape photography he does as well. Yeah, he does. Estrada with a nice jump serve. I think you're going to get your picture, Ashley. Wave, wave, wave at the camera. Oh, yep, mm -hmm. there he goes. <laughs> <laughs> he knew we were talking about him. Uh -huh. <laughs> I think Scott pointed this out. <laughs> Oh. Somebody was in the net? I think. Yep. Oh, two hits. What, uh, or was number it two. on number Num two? Number two was in the net. Man. Uh, volleyball is probably not my strongest sport to call, but we'll get through it. <laughs> <laughs> With all the club ball and all the seasons of watching Joe. Right. I've, I've kind of picked up a lot. Oh, definitely. Oh, nicely done. Is that Rodriguez? No. That was Mariana. Okay. Yes. She put it right in the middle of the defense. Uh oh. Uh, referee did not whistle it in. Going to redo it. Now we're set to okay. play. Okay. <laughs> oh. oh. Again, those are very tough yes. sets to hit. Tip over, right in the net. Wow. Man. Pass needs to clean up their passing game yes. a little bit, and I think they'll be all right. Ooh, two hits. Yeah. Yeah. Number five is going back to serve for casting, Madison Smith. Nice pass. Oh, strong hit, but too Ouch. strong. Too strong. This gets us tied back up at sevens. Down the one. Short. Nice hit. Oh, oh a little strong though. Number six, Abby Williamson looked at the official for something. I'm not sure what she 
Did she think it was touched? Maybe. I did not see it. I didn't. But. I didn't either. Oh, nice block by Rodriguez. For only being five eight, she can jump. Yeah, she, she does have some jumps. <laughs> Ooh, nice hit Maybe there. Caston's going to take a timeout. Time out. Yep. Probably a good idea there. Yep. We're going to take a timeout too. You're watching Caston TV on RTC TV4. At Co Alliance, we understand the importance of community. After all, we've been farmer owned since the 1920s. And now that we're a part of your community, we want to become your total agronomy solutions provider. Co Alliance offers the latest in ag technology for your operation. From field scouting and fertilizers to premium seed and precision agriculture, we can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources of your local cooperative to work. Contact Co Alliance today. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to game number one today between North Miami and Caston. North Miami took set one, 25-21, and leads set two, 11-7 right now. And they do have the serve. So coming out of a Caston timeout, that's number eight. Number nine. Number nine. Number nine. <laughs> nine. Oh. Oh. And that's usually what happens. Yep. After a timeout, your focus is lost, and sometimes you gotta kind of gather yourself. Yep. So definitely a good move on uh, Coach Schultz's part there. Lane Oliver with the jump serve. Ooh. Free ball. Back set. Hard hit. Height to the net. Block. Or the call in. Okay. In the net. Yep. Number two. I wasn't so sure which way that one was going to go yeah. <laughs> for a minute. Back row. Oh. Didn't get on top of the ball. Miss hit. Number 12 is going to check in. Rebecca Milburn. And Emma Wright checking in. Nice hit. Oh, two hits. Hoover enters for North Miami. Williamson with the serve for Caston. Tried to take the line on that one and yeah. good recovery from Caston. A strong hit. Oh, somebody was in the yeah. net. Yep. I saw a hand. I didn't know whose hand, but somebody's hand. Calling eight on that one. That is a oh. hard serve to handle. And a good heads up play by Marion Freeman to just. Yeah, tap it back. Yeah. In. I don't know if the official is a little slower to signal the serve um, than what North Miami is used to, or because that's yeah. the second server that almost served before. Right. Not that that's a bad thing for this official. It's just maybe different for them. He's I don't know. He's just trying to keep a time, yeah. and um, North Miami is used to a little bit yeah. quicker pace. They've done a great job, though, very consistent. Mm hmm I like having four officials out there instead of. Uh, and it's nice Nicely nice done. 
Musselman checks in. Oh yeah, I mean, the girls do an okay job mm -hmm. or, or whatever, but you know, you've got impartial people out there. Right. And they're keeping an eye on everything. Oh yeah. Nice recovery, oh. nobody's there. Oh. oh. Almost. Oh, good effort. Jellison kind of caught North Miami sleeping a little bit on that one. Lane Oliver back into the rotation. Oh, nicely done by. Rogers. That's what he wanted to do with that ball. Yep. <laughs> she knew exactly what where she was going with that. Yep. Ooh, nice serve. Nice recovery. Too tight to the net. Oh, oh. in the net. Yeah, the Good tight, effort. The, Good effort. the tight set yeah. put her way too close to the yeah. net. She did everything she could to yep. try to avoid it. but She was about in North Miami's front line, <laughs> though. <laughs> Nothing she could do. No, 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 no. Nicely done by Rogers. Oh, oh, oh. Tight, four yep. hits. I just get excited when somebody touches the ball. So I'm like, <laughs> it's great. <laughs> That's the girl you want to hit it. Yes, definitely. Oh, yep. there it is again. She loves that little uh -huh. push dump, yep. dump over. Again, another tight match. North Miami leads 18-16. They took set one, 25-21. Ooh, two hits. And Estrada's probably the girl casting once, once serving. She's got a nice jump serve. Well, that one was out of system. Marianne mm -hmm. took the second hit, yeah. so. You usually don't want your hitters to be the one setting. Right. Oh. Nice dig. Good effort. Off the hand. Marianne's going to try that dump again, or? Yep. Dig. Oh. and out of bounds. All tied up, 19. Yeah. Top tape oh. again. I think this might be the first time Caston's led this, this I think, set. I think so. 20 to 19, so. And so North Mr. Miami Lewis wants to take. talk it over. We'll take a break. You're watching Pioneer TV, Cast and TV on RTC TV4. At Co-Alliance, we understand the importance of community. After all, we've been farmer-owned since the 1920s. 
And now that we're a part of your community, we want to become your total agronomy solutions provider. CoAlliance offers the latest in ag technology for your operation. From field scouting and fertilizers to premium seed and precision agriculture, we can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources of your local cooperative to work. Contact CoAlliance today. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Caston leads North Miami 20 to 19 in set two of sectional volleyball action. North Miami took set one. Caston with the serve. In close to the yeah. to the net, and that's going to be a Caston point. No better time to take the lead than right? at the end of the game. Right? Absolutely. Oh, on the line. Wow. Wow. Let's see if we can take a quick look at that on replay, maybe. Is it going to let me? I don't think you got it. I oh. got it saved. It'll be on the highlight reel. There you so. go. Oh, oh, oh goodness. Yep. yep. Anything on the rafters, hard to play. Casting is two points away yeah. from tying, take, tying this match up. Tip oh. over. Oh. oh, man. So much effort on there for both sides. Estrada. Short. We have match point, or not match point, sorry, set point. Yeah. Set point number one. Good hard serve by Oliver. Ooh, two hits. Yeah. I just had a feeling you were going to call that one. He's called it all morning, so. He has. Yep, and hopefully Pioneer and Northfield has taken that to yeah. into consideration. Set point number two. Jellison. Nice hard hit. That was a good heads up play by Jellison. Yep. And well played by North Miami. They kind of yes. backed off the block. That was Preston's point in the net. Wow. And that is. Tied up, one to one. Tied up, set. I've got the replay up. There it is. I did not see her get in the net. I didn't either, but. I wasn't on the floor. So, Kasten takes set two, 25-21. So, we're all tied up, one to one. As advertised, a fantastic game so far, or match so far. We'll take another break real fast. You're watching Kasten TV on RTC TV4. Enjoy full screen television viewing of the new RTC TV4 family of networks anywhere you are with our new Roku channel. Simply purchase a Roku device from RTC or any Roku retailer, connect to your in-home Wi-Fi, then download the RTC TV4 channel. It's that easy. Watch all of our live channels 24 seven for free or subscribe to view all of our videos at your convenience. The RTC TV4 channel on Roku, another great service from RTC. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to sectional 52 volleyball action between North Miami and Caston. We are all tied up at 1-1, one, one. one apiece. So we knew this was gonna be a good match coming in and as advertised, it's been back and forth. And Caston actually had to go on a little rally in that second set to be able to take it. So 
Yeah, they did a good job of taking the lead when they needed to and, yeah. and pulled away at the end. So very, very fun to watch. Um, we did see a little more um, hard-hitting spikes that second set than what we saw in the first set. First set was a little more finesse, right. little tips over. So kind of feeling out the defense and yeah. how they're going to react to things. Both teams have been very scrappy, though, and have definitely played hard. They've got both teams have several seniors. So, right. you know, you're the great thing about Indiana sports is your record resets once you get to the sectional and, you know, everybody start starting out. Oh, and oh, yeah. So. You said uh, Coach Lynn over at, for North Miami has been around quite a long time. Yeah, I believe, like I said, I think he coached a little bit at Caston, um, probably about four years ago. Okay. And he's been a teacher at North Miami for I don't know how long. Uh huh. Like half a century, probably. Oh my. <laughs> Getting everybody set, make sure everybody's in the right spot. We're gonna get ready to start set three. Number four, Reese Hoover. Just gonna check in. See with the serve, get us started. Hard nice hit, man. Oh, very nice serve. Yes. Right over the front line and dumped it uh, before the 10, 10 foot line. Caston looks much more relaxed now. Mm -hmm. They were so just, they just looked frazzled right. like f through the first two sets. There's Marianne Freeman with another hard hit. Uh oh. Nope, not going to have enough. That was an interesting hit over the net. Um, yeah. I'm just going to leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> that was a nice hard hit in yeah. the block. Sometimes you got to do whatever you can to get it over Absolutely. the net. Absolutely. No, good heads up play again by Jellison. Oh. oh. Right in between them. Yep. Split the scene there. That was nice placement though, right there. And here comes North Miami back with a little rally of their own. Free ball. Marianne. Nice block. Oh. Almost a miscommunication on North Miami. Another hard hit. Yep.
Oh, oh man, she smacked that one. When you see the block sitting out on the inside, yep. take away the cross court, you go down the line. Good heads up play again. She wanted to hammer that one home, and Rodriguez was right there. I think she's seen the block a little late. Yeah. Uh, oh. oh, wow. Come on, Caston. You got this. I think North Miami sees a, uh, a little weakness over there on that far side yep. when they, uh, oh, did somebody win the net? Did I miss something? Uh, she called it out, but I thought it was touch. I thought it was touch too. Yep, he's got touch. Okay. I'm not sure why the side judge on the other side yeah, didn't call it. Yeah, I'm not. I think everybody was a little confused yeah. on that. But we're at a weird angle, so yeah. I mean, it could have looked like it was touched and not from up here. Right. And it, oh. Okay. And that side judge on that side may not have been able to see it. Yeah, that's true too. Angles are funny. Oh, definitely. Marion Freeman loves that little, uh, real close to the net, uh -huh. short serve. Oh, she decided not to chance it this time. <laughs> Got herself another ace, though. Yeah, she uh, put a little bit further and kind of snuck the defense. Uh, defense was sneaking up on her and pushed them back a little bit. I'm going to guess, yep, time we're going to have a timeout. Yep. Coach Schultz needs to talk it over. We'll be right back on Caston TV on RTC TV4. Enjoy full screen television viewing of the new RTC TV4 family of networks anywhere you are with our new Roku channel. Simply purchase a Roku device from RTC or any Roku retailer, connect to your in-home Wi-Fi, then download the RTC TV4 channel. It's that easy. Watch all of our live channels 24-7 for free or subscribe to view all of our videos at your convenience. The RTC TV4 channel on Roku, another great service from RTC. Over there, I think. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to sectional 52 volleyball action. We are tied up one set apiece between North Miami and Caston. North Miami leads set three, nine to four. Mary so, Freeman still yeah, serving. She's done a heck of a job back there. Kind of keeping the cast and comments uh, guessing. Again, goes a little bit longer than what she had been previously. Ooh. And that's going to be out, yeah. Cast needs to regroup here a little bit. Lane Oliver, oh, goodness. I've seen this with uh, Pioneer in the past mm -hmm. and other teams. You just get yourself caught in a bad rotation and it's hard to get out. Right. They just need a side out here and uh, then be able to regroup re and refocus. 
There, there we go. go. Man, you are Mr. Popularity this morning. Oh, that, was my, that was my brother. He, oh. <laughs> he uh, drove down from Michigan, actually. Okay. Oh. Oh, my. Double hit. Yeah. I, I was waiting for it off of the shoulder and... Push. Ooh, two hits. Oh, nicely wow. done by Rodriguez. She couldn't go over the net, but she popped her right back down. Mm-hmm. What are they doing? What? I'm not quite I, sure what that no. was about. I thought the server had the right to go anywhere on the baseline they wanted. I don't that, I don't know what he was talking about. I don't either. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. Everything is going right for North Miami in this set. Yes, it is. Right now they lead 15 to 6 over the Casting Comets. Oh. oh. She tried to do a little yeah. dump, but uh, the angle was bad. I'll tell you, she's fun to watch. She's so animated. Uh -huh. I love it. Oh, nice serve by Lane Oliver. Oh. oh. Yep. Oh, nice service ace. Change, change of pace. It looked like it was going to be a hard serve, yep. and she just kind of duffed it over. She has a very interesting approach to her jump serve, uh -huh. too. She kind of comes in at an angle. Oh. Tough. Oh, my Tough. goodness. <laughs> Lane Oliver, kind of a leader for cast and athletics, so. Wait a minute. What are we doing? Tying oh, a shoe. Tying a shoe. Shoe check. So, great person to have back on the service line. Oh, as I say that. <laughs> but, I mean, it was close. It was just, just slightly out. Well, we got a couple. Picked up, she picked up several points. It was oh, good. yeah. It was good. They just got to keep working on that yep. one point at a time. Overpass. Oh, right, right yeah. back in the middle. Hard That's hit up. by Jellison. Single hand, that was all right. Good volley going on here. Yes. Nice cut. Oh. oh. 
Yep. That was a good win for, for Caston winning that volley there. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Nice recovery. Oh. Yep. Reese Hoover, just a freshman. freshman. That's what I was looking at. Trying to figure out which Hoover boy that one belongs to. Right. Oh. Caught the tape, a good recovery. North Miami starting to close in on set point here. Best thing Caster can do is keep swinging away. Yeah, they one point at a time. Yep. They got one back there. Lane Oliver checks back in. They got some height back on the front row. I think they'll be all right. Yeah. Oh. They just can't make silly mistakes. Yeah. They kind of get something going and uh -huh. then mm -hmm. something happens. There's a nice hard hit again. Nice hard hit again. That's what I'm saying, on their, yeah. service, on their service line, they just need to get the ball over the net right. and play from there. Absolutely. As far as I know, I've never seen a five-point serve, so. Right, as absolutely. Long as, you, as long as you get it over the net, you got a chance. Yep. And saying that. Yep. So, update just from around the state. Um, Wabash Volleyball playing Fort Wayne Canterbury takes their match. 3-0, so congratulations to Wabash moving on to the championship. Now you mentioned uh, you're from the Oak Hill area. Mm -hmm. Is Oak Hill still in it? I'm not, I have no idea. I have no idea. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> My kids are young, so. Not following it yet. yet. I know they are playing in the boys soccer regional today though. Nice hit, not out. Another point. Let's keep going. Nothing fancy. Yep. Just get it over the net. Out of girl. Oh. Well played. Just right, right in the middle. North Miami has done such a nice job of that throughout this match. Yep. We haven't seen Amelia Lowry. Both in her yet. She's number 25, a 5'4 senior. Nice volley there.
Everybody's kind of keeping yeah. them alive. Oh, double hit. Uh, that's just a killer right there. Yep. You work so hard, and we've got set point. Short. And Kasten lives on with Lane Oliver. Nice hit. And got a service ace there for Oliver, so. Oliver's the one you would want back there serving yep. right now, because she can get him in bunches. Yep. That's gonna be tough to handle. Yeah. One more point, and I think Mr. Lynn will probably get a timeout. Yeah, I'm going to guess so. <laughs> and it's oh. a of. That's going to do it for set number three. North Miami takes it 25 to 18. They lead two to one. We'll take a quick break and we'll be back with set number four. You're watching Caston TV on RTC TV4. I don't think of this as a high school weight room. It's more like a high school classroom. I'm learning how to manage my time here. I'm learning that it's important to have goals and that it takes persistence and commitment to reach them. And I'm learning that the best way to lead is by example. Indiana High School Sports. They're more than just a game. Come and see me play. <laughs> yep. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Caston TV on RTC TV4, sectional 52 volleyball action. Between North Miami and Caston, North Miami leads two sets to one, going into set number four. So, as advertised, great volleyball this morning. Very, very good. Yes, it's exactly what I expected. I mean, both teams are well uh, evenly matched. Yes. And uh, they're playing uh, playing very good volleyball right yeah. now. Yeah. I think Cassie needs to clean up the middle a little bit. They're yeah. letting a few too many balls drop right in that donut area. Yep, definitely. And North Miami's, uh, they've done a nice job of recognizing some weaknesses on yep. Caston, on the Caston side and exploiting those weaknesses. Um, and that could be some of the coaching because, yeah. uh, like I said, Lynn's been around for a long time. So I think he was coaching volleyball when I was in school. Okay, so if yeah. That, if that tells you anything. <laughs> I've only been out a couple of years. Oh, uh, just a couple? A couple. <laughs> Didn't you just have a daughter get married? No, yeah. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but. Yes, I did. <laughs> And to be honest with you, Mr. Lynn was, I thought, old then. Oh, geez. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's no. a good character. He'll, uh, he'll take that well. Yeah. Pioneer folks rolling in. See a lot of yellow, black over on this side. Then you got the blue over on the other side, Northfield. Again, just a short little trip up the road for Northfield for Pioneer. About, about an hour, I would say. Maybe for a little Pioneer, more. Yeah. Uh, about an hour. For Northfield, probably about 10, 15 minutes. Right, yeah, it's not not very far, so. Just the other side of Wabash County. Yep. See who makes an adjustment in set number four to, right. to, uh, to take control here. Make sure everybody's in where they're supposed to be and we'll be ready to roll. Set number 
Looks like Haston will yeah. serve to start this first uh, third set. Fourth, fourth set, isn't it? Well, I've joked with you today about about your age, but <laughs> I, I'll just throw this out. I'm so old too that when I was in high school, there was no libero yeah. that played. So, I mean show my age a little bit too. I think I was maybe a sophomore in college when it was introduced. Now what about the rally point? When did they start the rally point scoring? I think maybe towards the end. Of, okay. But I could, if anybody's watching, um, early 2000s. Oh, nice. I think that sped the game up and made it a little bit more oh, fun yeah. to watch. I want to say though they went to rally scoring and then went back to the old way and okay. then back to rally scoring, maybe. Well, I, they well, were to trying show, to figure things out. Yeah, to show my age, if it touched the net, it was out. Right. It, when I was younger, that was the, the same way, so yeah. Net serve. That was a turn. Yes, it was, I remember. Because I think that was a rule that went back and forth, too, where it was okay. and then it wasn't and then it was. Ooh, oh, nice hard so hit. hard. That was Marion for you. Yep. She just needed to get a little bit more on yes. top of that. That was a nice Nicely hit. done. There you go. I think that's what she wanted to do last time. Yeah. Just did not, didn't have the right set or didn't, didn't have her body in position. You know, dealing with, with high school kids, a lot of this um, just comes down to a mental game. It does. Nice block. Single hand, that's all good. Tip. Oh, wow. Oh, so was, close. It, it was, was close. Good, it was a good thought because there was nobody covering yes. that corner. She didn't miss by much. No. Yeah, that corner was wide open. Yes. Nicely done. Casting caught the middle that time. <laughs> Good hard serve. Oh, that almost looked like a, a double hit. That was uh, on a or, serve you can't or have or lift. It, yeah, you can't lift. have that. You can't have that on a first hit. Oh. Any, anything counts on a first hit. Oh, really? Especially on a service. Okay, so that's a new rule, or a different rule uh, as okay. well. Again, showing my age. Because <laughs> you used to be able to get a double hit lift off of a serve. No, you cannot. Oh. Anything anything goes. You can hit See, I'm learning all sorts of things from you today. <laughs> Aside from catching the ball and throwing right, it. Right, right, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. My God, yeah, that middle, that middle is still open. Yep. See, I, I honestly had no idea that that 
anything went. Now I have seen some referees call, oh, that was a double hit. Um, some referees call different things mm -hmm. on a first hit, and Rod, Rod's like, seriously, on a first hit, that's not, so yeah. Four hits, and here comes Kasten back. Like I said, I thought they, they, they looked a little bit better. They're starting to find, yeah. find some weaknesses in North Miami side. Still playable. Oh. Nope. Good effort by yes. number five, Madison Smith. Rebecca Milborn checking in. That's a little far. And we got a tie ball game. Yes, we do. So. Part of that Fab Four from last year's Pioneer team, Mackenzie Campbell just walked in. That's Alexis Robinson, Mackenzie uh, yep, Campbell. And yeah. Alex yep. Yep. Just a good volley from both teams. Nicely done by Rogers. Amelia Lowry checking in again. Again, a senior gets to, to serve. It's a nice serve. Yeah. Oh. Checking in for casting number three, Grace Hart, serving for the Warriors, Battle of the Sea. Madeline C. Oh, nice hit. Nice hit. Ken Alanis over on the far side, another yeah. of the Fab Four. Oh, oh, just. Right Nicely that's, done. That's where you want to stick it because right now that's where the middle is open. Absolutely. Out of bounds. 
Casting within one. All right. Great job by Madison Smith and Abby Williamson. I said, they got some size up on that front they line. They do. They can do some damage. Oh. oh. Good effort by Estrada. Rodriguez is... Uh, She's kind of a firecracker for North Miami. Gets yep. them going. She's back in the lineup. That was not open that time. Back set. Out of system. Still nice, nice slow down, nice recovery. That's going to be trouble, but I think they're going to recover. Yeah. Oh, two oh. hits, out of yep. system. Such a great volley between the two teams and Estrada and oh, just just didn't really have anything they could do with that one. Hi. Recover, recover. Yeah. There you go. There. Tried to hit that middle. Hard hit. Nice job by Freeman. Oh. oh Cut the seam. Madison Smith. Oh, they put the points up on the wrong side, I think. Yep, there, there they, they go. go. They got it. Oh. We just have to get in good points. Yeah. Got to get the serves in. A little confusion. We were yeah. out of system on that one. North Miami starting to pull away a little bit here. Not sure what we're yeah. questioning here. Are they questioning the rotation? I don't know. Not sure. Tough angle. Nope. Yep. You're starting to see some frustration yep. on uh, Caston's face. That's, that's a good timeout. Yes, it is. We'll take one, too. You're watching Caston TV on RTC TV4. RTC Fiber Communications is proud to announce the new RTC TV4 family of networks. Now you can watch nine local video channels dedicated to covering the events that are important to you from anywhere in the world, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you can watch for free. Just download the mobile app, our new Roku channel, or online at www.rtctv4.com. The RTC TV4 family of networks. Start watching today. Welcome back to sectional 52 volleyball action between North Miami and Caston. North Miami leads two sets to one and leads fourth set 19-14, so Coming out of a cast and timeout, good call. You can see the 
could see the frustration on Caston's face. Get him calm down and yep. see if we can take it. I'm not sure there was a tip there. Not calling a tip. Nope. nope. All right. Too tight. Oh. Oh. Played it well. Yes. At this point, it's it's survival, so it is survival. Get, get those points. And again, you got Lane Oliver serving, so that's good. Man, does she, she serve just, oh. every rotation? <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, at there. Least, at least once every rotation. Right? <laughs> It just seems like she's been back there a lot. <laughs> she needs to bring him up just a little yeah. bit. There oh. you go. I'd bring him down just a little <laughs> bit now. <laughs> That's out. Another point, Caston. This would be a good time for them to take a lead. Right. I don't know if Mr. Lynn will let it get to that, but we'll see. Nicely done. She finally split the middle, and that was about right. Uh -huh. <laughs> yep, there's, there's a timeout. Yep, I had a feeling. We'll go ahead and take one more ourselves. You're watching Casting TV on RTC TV4. At Co-Alliance Propane, we treat our customers like neighbors because, well, that's what we are. When you trust Co-Alliance Propane as your seriously local propane provider, you're trusting a team of professionals who live, work, and watch the game from right across the county, not the country. A team that's close by and seriously dedicated to your safety and providing the best service possible. Find out more about Co-Alliance Propane's seriously local service and how you can get 50 gallons of propane free at CoAlliancePropane.com. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. North Miami leads Caston 20 to 18 in set number four. And North Miami leads two sets to one. Lane Oliver serving. Oh. Uh, that's going to be out. 21 18, North Miami. And again, that was a good timeout by Mr. Lynn. Yes. It really takes a lot of effort to come back in and serve. Get oh, the focus, definitely. Get the focus back. No different than icing a kicker in football, any of those. Yep. Oh, oh, that was a and hard that was, hit. Yes, it was. was that and that was, was Jellison, wasn't it? Yeah. And that was tipped, so back over to the Comets. I think that was hit so hard it was a tip and still in. Right. <laughs> That's going to be trouble. Yep. Comments within one. The name of the game is keep the serve in bounds yes. though right now. Uh, at this point, that's the best. Ooh, that was uh, almost oh. two hits. <laughs> Boy, oh. back to back, back to back. Possibly could have been yeah. two hits, but worked out for the cast and comments. Yeah, they are tied up in this game. Mr. Lynn will probably no. Nope, he's going to sit down. What's he going to do? Nice hard hit. Oh, nice, nice recovery. Uh, uh, we've seen a, a lot of good plays uh -huh, scrappy, this morning. Very scrappy. Reese Hoover, a freshman, freshman. serving. Probably, uh, no doubt, the biggest serves of her career thus far. She's got a good serve. Yeah, she does. Oh, that's oh. Two hits. Although. You know probably just as well as anybody that freshmen aren't really freshmen like 
freshmen like they used to be right. with all the club and. Right. Nice hit. Trouble, trouble, trouble. Yep. Not just uh, in volleyball, but any sport. They play so much before they even get to the high school level. Good hard serve from Lowry. Freeman, oh. nice block. Tied up again, 23. And you got a senior back serving. Everybody's fighting for their season. Freeman again. Tried to get oh. baseline. Oh, nice hit. Nice recovery. Out of system. Close oh. oh, they stayed over. Man. He wasn't going to call that on a big point like that. Yeah. Good volley, good volley. Hard hit. Nobody wants to lose this point. Oh, little miscommunication. Another Hard hit. hit. Oh, still my alive, goodness. Still alive, still alive. Oh, get it over. Oh, not no. enough. Ooh. Wow. That was a good volley. We have uh, seven. I mean, now you've got uh, pioneer folks over here that I think are sweating after that one. <laughs> Everybody was on the edge of their seat, and we've got a timeout. We're going to just keep it right here. Yep, set point for North Miami. Yeah, 24 23. Set point, match point. Match point. Potential match yeah. point. Yeah, crazy. This has been a great morning so far. And obviously we will be pushed back for Pioneer Northfield. It's already 1240, so. Oh, wow. Yeah, doesn't seem like it should be, be that late, but. 24-23, North Miami. They hold a 2-1 lead for sets. C is going and to be the server. And a senior serving match point. Estrada, Jellison, Smith, hard hit. Oh! oh. Tied up at 24. And cast and lives on, Lane Oliver. Enters, Jellison back. Jellison just needs to get these serves in. Don't be cute, just get them yeah. in. Yeah. a girl. Good serve. Nicely done by Freeman. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Everything she could do was to get her finger on Lane that. Oliver in the hole, still alive. Back row, in, set. Hard so hit, hit, point. yes. 25-24, Kasten with a set point here. Yes. Nice hard serve. Freeman, nice, nice block. block by Rogers. Oh. Kind of a carry, but not yeah. called. Too close to the net, two hits. Cast and ticket. Wow. Now we'll play uh, one set to 15. Yeah. So we are tied up two sets to two sets. We'll take a break. You're watching Casting TV on RTC TV4.
RTC Fiber Communications is proud to announce the new RTC TV4 family of networks. Now you can watch nine local video channels dedicated to covering the events that are important to you from anywhere in the world, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you can watch for free. Just download the mobile app our new Roku channel, or online at www.rtctv4.com. The RTC TV4 family of networks. Start watching today. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Casting just took a set number four. That was nuts. 26-24. Two sets to two sets. Going into set number five, cast and people are fired up. Yes, they are. They're all up on their feet. They're having fun. That's what it's about, too. So both teams have quite a few seniors on them. And, and they seem to be fighting for their lives. Yeah, they so are. Perfect. That's exactly what you want your seniors to do. I'm not sure who won the toss there to see who gets the ball, but we'll find out here soon. Yeah. Only playing set number five to 15 points opposed to 25. So this game will. It's going to be who gets the run early. Right. Is going to start off Lowry uh, back at the service line. Yeah. Looks like they won the toss. That's exciting for a senior to, to be in that position to start things off. Northfield field down on the corner here. Um, ready to come out. Pioneer still hasn't. They may be in the other gym, though. They may be. I seen Rod still down here at the uh, corner. Yeah. Talking to his former players. Yes. Let me check and see if my pocket. Right. Let's see if I can guess how much money. Uh, <laughs> in and get out what is the, <laughs> What would somebody have in their pocket to lose? <laughs> I'm gonna go thirty-five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Amelia, Amelia Lowry to start off set number five. Nice, nice serve. serve. Oh, Hard nope, hit nope. and just not an, not nope. able to get there. It's going to be four hits. I figured that. You did not yeah. go over. Oh. Good opportunity. Nice. Yep. Nicely done by Rogers. Kind of an overpass. Yeah. And, uh, Took advantage of it. Jellison back to serve. A little cross court there. Oh, rare miss hit for Freeman. Caston takes an early 2 1 lead. And Jellison just needs to get the serves in. Overpass. Push. Tight to the net. Nope. I, yeah, I was going to say, there is a whole lot going on. Yeah, I think I called out a lift. 
I wasn't sure what it was, but it didn't look natural. Yeah, there was something that was wrong with it. Just get it in. Nope. Oh. That's kind of been their Achilles heel all day is they one, as service. long as they can keep the ball in bounds, they yeah. do all right. Service errors do kill. Yeah. yeah. Push. Marianne, another miss hit. Wow. Legs are getting a little tired. Yep. I mean, we're going on almost two hours of volleyball right, right. now. Doesn't seem like that to us, but. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice heads up play by Lane yep. Oliver. And this is what I'm talking about, the early early lead. Yep. They got the 5-2 five, five lead. Still, Keep still, the spirits up. Yeah, and yeah. That's a good set. A little tight to the net. Overpass. Oh. oh. A little softer than what she anticipated yeah. and just came down with her. Freeman back for the serve. That's probably a good decision. That, that was, was yeah. That was tight. Oh. oh, that hurts. Oh, just didn't quite get a good receive, serve, receive, and. Tied up. Yeah. Marianne has been serving well. Yes. And I'm not so sure, is this the rotation that Kasten had trouble with earlier? I kind of think it was, maybe. Oh, get it over, there you go. So all they need to do is break serve here. Come up, make the play, there you go. Yep, just keep it alive. Hard hit by Rodriguez. Push. Oh, two hits. Oh. And here comes North Miami, takes their lead for, I believe, first lead. Second yep. lead, 6-5. Hard hit. Nicely done by North Miami. Three Don't ball over. over. Ball. Out. Out. Tied back up, 6-6. Six, six. No touch. Smith. And again, she's had some issues getting it over. Mm -hmm. Just need to put it over the net. There Perfect. Go. Good idea. Good idea. Oh! oh. Wow. Nicely done. Caston takes the lead back. And exactly what we expected, back and forth. Yep. And there, there it is again, unfortunately. Stein, a senior, I believe. And miss it. North Miami now leads, 8-7. A little short serve. Oh. 
Oh, oh goodness. That was kind of a mess there at the, the net. Two point lead for North Miami. We need to break serve here. Nice block. Yep. I'm going to guess we're going to see a timeout. She's inching yep, towards yep, yep. <laughs> Coach Schultz wants to talk it over. We're, we'll just keep it here. North Miami leads 10 to 7, set number 5. Crazy morning so far. Kind of the, uh, kind of the match I'd expect that yeah. to. I know Caston struggled in the HNAC, and I don't believe North Miami had a win in the, uh, the no. Three Rivers Conference. So I think this is just playing for pride at this point. Yeah. The seniors have got to be playing for their uh, for their season. Yeah, absolutely. North Miami able to set it up. Oh, oh and nice. no hit ball. Yeah. I don't know which way uh, Marianne's more dangerous, in the back row or in the front I row. I know. She, she uh, has done a nice job today. She's been a cleanup uh, girl back there. She's a, uh... nope, antenna. Side out here, Caston. Keep this thing alive. Yes. Yeah. I was gonna say that was a touch. Yep. That's what you needed. Laying all over back to serve. So let's get a few points back yes. here. Nice serve. That's one of them. And I wouldn't be surprised. A couple, couple. Of, oh, uh, nice serve. If Lane serves a few uh, points here. Mr. Oh, Lim oh, that's nope. four. Nope. Mr. Lane can save the timeout. Oh, oh miss hit. And now we have set point. Yeah, match, match point. point. Nice hard, hard hit. hit. Two hits. Casting lives on. Set point, match point number two. Serving for casting number six, Abby Blues. Name of the game is get it over the net. Yeah, absolutely. Oh. Oh. And again, that goes back to what us. Oh, yeah. and that's going to do it. Yep. North, Mi point. North Miami takes set number five, 15 to 10. So we've got North Miami took. Set one, 25-21. Caston set, took set two, 25-21. North Miami took set three, 25-18. Caston set four, 26-24. And North Miami set five, 15 to 10. I tried to keep stats and I, no. I got too intrigued. No, nope. nope. That's not my forte. I'm much better at basketball stats. Um, 
such a great game. At least you brought a pen because I didn't even know. <laughs> so we'll take a quick break. Um, I'm going to see if I can quick run down and get Coach Lynn uh, up here for a quick interview. I'll just leave it on the court. You're watching Cast and TV on RTC TV4. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Coach Lynn and uh, Coach Schultz, kind of hard to track down right now. So uh, North Miami takes game number one. I just ran up and down the bleachers. I'm like short of breath. <laughs> um, North Miami takes game number one at the sectional, or I guess technically game number two of sectional 52. We're gearing up for Northfield and Pioneer. So. Um, that's going to do it for us on Cast and TV for Dennis Walker and Steve Stricker on Tech. I'm Ashley Moore. Thanks for watching Cast and TV on RTC TV4. Yeah.